vlog because my parents are here visiting and I feel like when your parents visit, you're not really sure what to do because a lot of times you're doing other things when you're in New York City and maybe you don't want to take them to like your local bar. So what we did the last two days, which I did a little bit of vlogging, but I wanted to do like an actual intro today because I'm finally off work and we're going to have like full on, have full days. So we, on Wednesday night, we went to a comedy club, The Stand, over in Union Square, over by 14th Street. It was so fun. I got to see Ashley Heseltine, who's the host of DGE. So that was like a fun experience to see her in person. She's great. And then we had dinner there and then last night we went to see Wicked. It was a whole thing We were supposed to go see Sarah Jessica Parker and her show and then we ended up seeing Wicked So it was overall good, but we ended up getting like bad tickets because like we got them literally the day before the show But all is well that was really fun So always going to the theater is a good option and then today We're just gonna bop around the city as well as tomorrow and I'll take you guys along with me and I hope you guys enjoy it. So make sure to follow if you haven't yet. My name's Mallory, I live in New York City, and I work in fashion, but I also do vlogging and lifestyle content. So hope you guys enjoy this one, and let's go. Yay! All right, so I met up with my parents. They're staying at a hotel super close to me. So it's just a quick walk to Subway, and then we're gonna go to brunch at the One Hotel, because it's really close to Central Park, and then we'll make our way through the city from there. Say hello. <laughs> Okay, typical me, booked the wrong day for the reservation, so we're doing a little wait in the lobby area. We are at the One Hotel, it's gorgeous. I mean, it smells delicious here, so pretty. I love it. And they have nice books for us to occupy ourselves with. Yeah, there's some cool pictures in there. This is what it looks like from the Westlight. Okay, we had a glorious little brunch and now we got some coffees from this cute little coffee shop right down the street from one hotel. And now we're gonna walk through Central Park. So we're gonna start by going through the zoo. I had a feeling maybe we could go to the zoo, but I think, you know, we'll leave it to the children today. And we'll just do a little gander, you know, just a little pop in, if you will. You can see a literal seal just hanging in the middle of New York City. It's a gorgeous zoo though. Like look at all these flowers. I'm on a mission again. Loving the people watching, so. <laughs> so we're back. We kind of took a little hour and a half break. I cleaned a little bit. My mom helped me pack up a bunch of stuff to bring back home so she can help me to resell everything. Make sure to check out our Poshmarks. They're all linked in the description box. And now we're off to dinner. We're going to Westlight in Brooklyn. It is so gorgeous. You get the full view of the city. You do have to book reservations about three weeks out and they come available every like three weeks prior. So you kind of have to like remember. I put a like notification to get in there because it's just a great view. It's so good to take people there. It is in Brooklyn again. So it does take a little bit time. I think it's like a 40 minute train ride there, but it's worth it because it's so fun. And then we'll probably just Uber back because we're lazy. But this is what I'm wearing tonight. And I went through like five different shoe options and I landed on some boots because it is like gonna be 50 degrees So I'm gonna do that this, this like silky skirt. It's from Vince Um, I will say I got both of these things at a sample sale so cheaper obviously, you know me And then this is like a designer cute beautiful 
sweater and this bag is from whistles i did buy this and i did buy the shoes so yeah this is the full situation actually i think both of these were christmas presents i'm not so sure but boom to the boom let's go Dad's at the thrift store. Dad, come get in the golden hour. Today. I'm not gonna lie, but we're gonna go get some breakfast. My mom's hungry So we're gonna go to this restaurant called blank slate It's a good distance from my apartment, but it's walkable So we're gonna go there and then we have a boat ride in Chelsea later today So we it's currently like 9 30 So we're gonna go get the breakfast and then I'm gonna get ready I like didn't do my makeup or anything. I just kind of I'm wearing just like a random outfit We're just gonna quickly like run get coffee and breakfast and then come back get ready go to the boat down by Chelsea and me and my dad are gonna get like pizza or something my mom's gluten-free so it's kind of a hard issue you know you gotta get the gluten-free in there so that's why we're doing a bigger breakfast so I don't know I'm probably just gonna get coffee honestly I'm not like starving but if they're both gonna get breakfast then I'll get breakfast it's a whole thing I don't know why I'm rambling on we're gonna go get food okay let's go how freaking cute they have these little outdoor greenhouses all right so i went through about 30 different outfits and this is where we landed i'm wearing this coat i thrifted this is from zara it's like a little bodysuit and then i also packed a t-shirt because i just don't know what to expect with this look like weather so i know it'll be like pretty windy and then we'll be in a closed in boat so i, I don't know this is what we're doing okay and then these are the like jeans that i'm wearing i like these jeans but they do stretch out so i'm gonna be annoyed but you gotta do what you gotta do and then I'm wearing some booties. So here's the fit. Okay, so we just got off the subway. Beautiful sounds of Midtown New York City. I think my camera's gonna die, so I didn't bring it. And then now my phone's at 40% suddenly, and it's like not even noon. So I'm kind of freaking out, but we're gonna try to get content on all three of our phones and we'll have ourselves a little video. But right now we're just like walking around looking for somewhere to eat because I didn't really know this area that well. And we're just gonna try to see what's down here um, and hopefully we find something cute and fun or we might not find anything and then we're screwed. So we'll keep you updated obviously. Okay, so we got lunch. It was really good. They had great garlic knots, highly suggest. And now we are walking around Chelsea Piers because I thought there might be like a way or a line or I didn't really know, but I guess it just boards five minutes before instead of, I thought it would be like 15, 30 minutes before. We've been really like flying out the seat of our pants these days. So we wanted to be organized today. So we were a bit early. So now we have like 40 minutes to kind of walk around. This is the golfing. Chelsea Piers has a lot to offer. I think it has bowling, roller skating, really good for families. Um, I've never been over here, so this is new for me, but it seems pretty cool. I'm definitely gonna keep this in mind next time I have visitors too. So I'm excited for the boat today. Yay! This is the boat we are about to get on. It was about $106 per person, including one beverage. And you can also order food on the boat, but we weren't sure about that, so we only did drinking. But it was so amazing. It was all of our favorite parts. You literally go from Chelsea Piers all the way through the Statue of Liberty, up the west side through like the Brooklyn area, all the way to Harlem and back down on the west side and it was gorgeous. And then I was like, let's go to the little golf course. It's right here at Chelsea Piers. My dad loves to golf. He's like literally was a professional back in the day. And we had a lot of fun just playing around. Me and my mom are not like great at it by any shot, but it was something to do and it was really fun. And we only were there for about 45 minutes. Okay, I'm in a restaurant. 
So we came back, got dressed. I'm wearing just like a black, all black. I don't know. I'm just like not feeling like an outfit today. And now we're gonna go with the best rigatoni in the freaking world. I'm so excited. They have them all across different parts of New York City. La Cora Bianca. I'm probably saying it wrong, but just forgive me. Um, we just had a little happy hour right across the street, and then we're gonna go get our reservation. So that's the that's the vibe right now. starting to fail at doing outros as you can see i'm literally finishing up the finishing touches of this week's video this is it this was the best trip ever my parents have not both been in new york city at the same time in two years uh for obvious reasons you know panorama related um but it was so nice for them to be here and my dad got to see my apartment here and we really just had the best weekend kind of hanging out and i worked for the work week and then after work is when we did the fun things like on the comedy club, which I was so in love with. I want to go again. It's $25 per person and you don't have to eat or drink. So a lot of the comedy clubs, you have like a minimum and you end up spending like 100 each, which is so fine. There's literally nothing wrong with that. But I just liked this option and I feel like I'm going to definitely try to go with like friends and stuff. It was a little bit of a younger crowd. And then because Sarah Jessica Parker had, you know, COVID, then that was kind of a mess up. And I didn't get off work till a certain time. So then with the traffic, we were running late for our dinner reservation. And we ended up just not, it was like kind of a fail of the day, but it was fun nonetheless. And then everything started to get better once the weekend came, obviously. Always happens like that. And I think the number one thing... I would say that everyone needs to do is the boat tours. There's so many options available. We did the Manhattan Yacht Tour, Architecture Tour, which I just really enjoyed because I liked what they were talking about. I guess they said something about you could take a how it works one where they talk about the sewage and how things like changed throughout history. And then there's dinner ones where they have jazz bands and breakfast ones where you couldn't have like full, full meals. Um, which people were ordering like apps and stuff on the boat that we were at, but we had just eaten as you saw, which that place was also delicious. They had the best garlic knots. I, I mean, we just had a blast. So I hope this was helpful if your parents are coming in town or if you're always looking at my channel. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and let me know if you have any questions. All of the links are going to be in the bio of everywhere we went, kind of our like itinerary. So you can come back to the video. So save it or whatever if you need to come back to it. And um, yeah, I hope you have an amazing time in New York if you're on your way here or if you're just curious about it. This was the best. So I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. New videos every Thursday. Yay!